Warning, this video and channel may not be suitable for children. Viewer discretion is advised. With that being said, I hope you enjoy. You have been warned. Of course, I'm going to drink good old lemon lime Sprite here for this Thoughts and Grades video for God of War 3 Remastered. Hello everyone, this is the official k -On Gaming HD. One down, one more to go. So, enough talk, let's get right to it. We're going to start off here a little bit differently than the infamous Second Sun grading video and we're going to start off with the graphics first for God of War 3 Remastered. For a PlayStation 3 port, a PlayStation 3 Remastered for the PlayStation 4, this game doesn't look that bad. It's not jaw dropping or anything, it's not anything that's going to knock your socks off. You know, it's not like it's a sequel, God of War 4, which came out in 2018. It's nothing amazingly jaw-dropping, graphic-defying like that. But for a remaster of a PlayStation 3 game that I believe came out in 2010, if I remember correctly. Yeah, I'm pretty sure I'm right. 2010, I hope I'm right. If not, I'll put it here in the... Uh, actually... Ah, my phone's on the charger. I'll check later on. But I'm pretty sure this game came out in 2010, and then it was remastered in 2016, I believe. So, for a PlayStation 3 remastered to PlayStation 4, it doesn't look that bad. Graphics-wise, I'm gonna go... I'm gonna go 7 out of 10. For the graphics not perfect you know not perfection not 10 out of 10 graphics but pretty damn good graphics nonetheless so 7 out of 10 for the graphics all right before we get to the next part of the grading system let me give me another drink of sprite real quick i'm not sponsored by the way it's just sprite's my favorite drink of all time but anyways Moving on to the next part here on the grading system, the soundtrack slash sound design for God of War 3 Remastered. If I had to sum up the soundtrack and the sound design for this game in one word, it would be this. Bad ass. This game has one of the best soundtracks and sound designs I have ever heard in a video game in my entire gaming life. It isn't the best I've ever heard, but it's damn near up there. So for the soundtrack and sound design for this game alone, I'm bestowing upon it a 10 out of 10. A perfect score across the soundtrack and sound design board. Legendary soundtrack, legendary sound design. I like God of War 2018 sound design and soundtrack a little bit more. But this one is still up there as one of the best I've ever heard. So props to Santa Monica Studio. I can't wait to hear the soundtrack they have planned for God of War Ragnarok. I can't wait for that. I know they're not going to let us down on that. Hopefully. And now, ladies and gentlemen, we move on to the gameplay part of the grading system. My God. God of War 3 Remastered. Let me just say this real quick. When I first started this Let's Play series, my friend Shy told me that I would fall in love with the gameplay of God of War 3 more than I did the gameplay of God of War 2018. And at first I didn't believe him. At first, you know, I blew it off like, okay, I know the gameplay is going to be good, but I don't see it topping God of War 2018. I don't see it being that, 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 that good. Well, 
He was right. God of War 3 Remastered has some of the most goriest, bloodiest, just downright, just badassery gameplay. I'm not even sure if badassery is a word. Fuck it, I'm going to say it anyway. Some of the most badassery gameplay I have ever played. While I still love God of War 2018 gameplay, I gotta give credit where credit's due that God of War 3 Remastered, so far, until God of War Ragnarok comes out, we have not seen any gameplay trailers for that. We don't even know what the game freaking looks like. God of War 3 Remastered has, in my opinion, the best gameplay of any God of War game that's ever been made. We'll see what happens when God of War Ragnarok comes out, but for now, God of War 3 has the best gameplay of any God of War ever. I'm bestowing upon the gameplay 10 out of 10. Another 10 out of 10 here for the grading system, and rightfully fucking earned. This gameplay makes you want to run through a fucking wall at how good it is. The only issue that I could say I had with it was I really wished later on in the game I could have had the ability to adjust the difficulty to hard mode. I unfortunately only got to play the game on normal difficulty. I wanted to put it on... I want to put it... I can't even talk! I wanted to put it on hard difficulty, but unfortunately the game would not let me unless I wanted to start an entire brand new series right from the very beginning and I did not want to do that so I stuck with it and even on normal difficulty I had a lot of fun with this gameplay and now here on my grading system is the story part oh boy I love the story here in this game so many great moments so many legendary moments especially the ending of the game and that final boss battle. God, I wish I could have played that final boss battle on hard difficulty. I want it so badly to play it on hard difficulty. Because I feel like that's how the boss battle should have been played. But unfortunately, I couldn't, you know, change the difficulty. That's something that really irks me about the game. That's one of my major gripes for God of War 3. Is it wouldn't give you the ability to up the difficulty. It would give you the ability to lower the difficulty if the game got too, you know, a little too hard, which it did a few times at parts for me. It asked me if I wanted to lower the difficulty. I wish I could have raised the difficulty, especially at the end of the game, but unfortunately I couldn't do that. But nonetheless, the story part here, I love it. Like I said, many great moments, many legendary moments. The ending really threw me off. One of the most surprising endings to a video game that I've seen in a long, 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 long while. But I didn't enjoy it as much as God of War 2018. I'm sorry, I just think God of War 2018 just has a little bit better story. I'm sorry, I don't mean to offend any God of War fans out there. I just prefer the story in God of War 2018 a little bit more than the story in this one. And that's no offense, you know, to this game. That's no offense to God of War, but it's just my personal taste. I prefer the story in 2018 better than the story here. Not saying the story is bad. Now, I gave the story in God of War 2018 a 10 out of 10. For the story here, I'm going to go 9 out of 10. It falls just short of a 10 out of 10 because, one, I wasn't able to up the difficulty like I wanted to, and two, I didn't enjoy it as much as 2018's story. I'm sorry. It's, it's just how I feel. I like 2018's story in God of War 4 a little bit more than the story here in this one. I, I hope 
I hope you know you can understand that. I hope we're cool. I hope we're fine with that. I just prefer the story in 2018 more than this one. So nine out of ten for the story, which is still a really damn good grade. A nine out of ten is still a really, really damn good grade, near perfection. So now I move on to my overall final grade of God of War 3 Remastered as a whole. This Let's Play series of God of War 3 Remastered was a lot of fun. I enjoyed it. I hope you all enjoyed it as well. If you have not seen it, go check it out. Link to the playlist will be down in the description box below for all of my God of War 3 Remastered Let's Play videos. I know that I unlocked a whole bunch of uh, new costumes, new outfits at the end of the game. If I wanted to, I could go back and replay the game on hard difficulty with those costumes, but unfortunately my plus is going to expire literally in about, I think, nine days. Actually, six o'clock as I'm recording. Eight days. Eight more days until my PlayStation Plus expires. And then I won't be able to play any of my PlayStation Plus games. That's a story for another day. I'm, I might do a video talking about PlayStation Plus. I don't know. I, I might. But... I don't know. Maybe I could pick this game up someday in the future. I'm not going to pick it up for $20. I'm not going to pay a full 20 bucks for it. Maybe at best I'll wait for it to go on sale and... If there's no other game for me to get, maybe I'll pick this up for 10 bucks. You know, maybe just to play through it again with the new outfits and stuff. Who knows? But that's it for God of War 3 Remastered as a Let's Play series here on the channel, though. God of War 3 Remastered. Hmm. Putting everything together, mixing it up, all the grades and everything that I gave for this game. Alright, I've decided. My final overall grade of God of War 3 Remastered is a very, very damn impressive 9 out of 10. The only issue that I really had with this game is that I wish I could have adjusted the difficulty during the game, during the story, and not have to make an entire brand new game on hard difficulty. I should have done a Let's Play series on hard difficulty. That's where I completely messed up. I would have loved to have done that Zeus boss battle at the end of the game on, the, on hard difficulty. That would have been absolutely badass. It would have been tough. He would have whipped my ass. But I would have had so much fun playing that. I would have got pissed off too. But man, at the end of it, it'd be freaking worth it. And unfortunately, you know, I didn't get the chance to do that. It was still hard nonetheless, even on normal difficulty. But he, but man, I wish, I really wish I could have had that chance to play it on hard. And also... Even though I think the gameplay here in this game is better than God of War 2018, I still prefer God of War 2018. I'm sorry, it's just my personal taste. I like God of War 2018 a little bit more than this game. I gave God of War 2018 a 10 out of 10. I'm giving God of War 3 a 9 out of 10. It falls just below the essential rating which would be a 10 out of 10. 10 out of 10 would be basically essential, meaning it's a must-own, must-play game. But a 9 out of 10 is very damn impressive nonetheless, and I do recommend going out there and pick this up on, pick this up on sale. I mean, if you want to pay full price for it, fine and dandy, but I recommend picking this up on sale. I think it no actually it's not on the PlayStation Plus collection it's not on the PlayStation Plus collection now that I remember but I do recommend picking this game up and playing it and trust me you're gonna enjoy it just as much as I did so 9 out of 10 for God of War 3 Remastered and with that 
my grading videos are now done I can get back to recording these let's play series here on the channel so thank you all so much for watching and I will see you in my next video here on the official K on gaming HD I know this wasn't the best you know grading video on YouTube surrounding God of War 3 people have done better but hey you know I tried and tell me what you thought of God of War 3 in the comments below tell me your thoughts and grades anyway that's enough for this video thank you all so much for watching I am out peace Bye.